Second year head coach Sam Tudor is helping put the Flathead girls basketball team back on the map. Coming off of a season of just winning two games, the Bravettes are now 8-0. They've been playing together for a long time and that's that's one of the things that we're seeing and also uh, last year they were mostly sophomores and freshmen and this year you know there's been that year of maturing. And a lot of girls on this team have just been putting work in just in general and we all are just super excited for each other and have lots of energy and really supportive of each other so I think just the overall atmosphere and the hard work we put in has been the difference. And although there's only one senior on the team that change in atmosphere starts with leadership. Like, yeah we have a great record but a lot of our games are really close and the difference in those games is our, our leadership coming through. Second year head coach Sam Tudor has also been a difference maker this season. After winning a state title at Big Fork with their boys team, Tudor knew how to carry over a winning culture. First year we didn't get a summer with him so it was kind of like we just went right in the season and um, we had all these new plays and stuff so he, I really like him because he goes hard in practice, but he also cares about us off the court. Um, Big Fork was great to me, but uh, these girls have been just so special coming down the line. We had a lot of great work this summer and, you know, just coming off all the challenges that uh, COVID has, has brought upon us as coaches. Um, these girls are definitely such a huge reprieve for me and they're just a breath of fresh air. They're, they're doing really good. And with the relationship Coach Tudor was able to make with this team, he believes he doesn't only have a group of women who lead on the court, but off it as well. I think there's just such a bright future for these young women. Um, and just for example, it's, it's finals week right now and we had a game on Friday and they were studying up to two hours before. I had to tell them to put the homework away and I, that's kind of the antithesis of what I do as a teacher, but it was just, um, they take not just basketball, everything they do and they, and they do it to the best of their abilities. And that alone, I mean, I, I don't know exactly what they'll be doing 10 years from now, but I know they'll be leaders in, in some capacity. Reporting in Kalispell, Alexa Belcastro, MTN Sports.